Hello, I'm T. Hoffman, and it's time for another Two Minute Tuesday. I'm the Managing Principal here at Law Strategy Coach, and I really appreciate you joining us this week. Today, I want to talk about something that I feel is really important and sometimes in law firms is not talked about enough, and that's client satisfaction. How do you know that your clients are satisfied with you? Obviously, if they keep using you, you know they're satisfied with you, but do you routinely look for ways to make sure clients are satisfied? I bet if you're honest, we don't do it enough. So one of the things I wanna talk about today is an article that my friends Karen and David put together. They're with Gimbal Canada, and they put together a tip of the week every week that really focuses on how law firms can work more efficiently and more effectively. And the tip they put out last week was about client satisfaction, but it was also about the other things that had been identified as key attributes of lawyers that were really important to clients. And those included efficiency, obviously doing things, making sure the right person is doing the task so they're not overbilled, economy, in other words, they want to know what it costs, and if you go over, they want to know if you're going to go over. So that whole communication thing, how effective are you? And they can judge that, your clients can judge that, obviously, by how well they're doing on your particular matter, but also they want to know that from your outward-facing marketing materials. So make sure that you're putting things that indicate that you've had success in particular areas in the past, and then they want predictability. They don't want to be surprised, right? No clients ever want to be surprised. And communication is key to all of this, including the outcomes that you're going to get from your clients, whether you win or lose. If you're communicating along the way, if you have the right people doing the right jobs, if you've quoted the right price for the job, or at least notified them if you're going to go over budget, and if you are predictable, in other words, you're letting them know along the way what they can expect because we all know things change pretty rapidly in a lot of different legal matters. So you've got to continue to focus on letting them know. And then I advise my coaching clients to always do an after action report. And I've talked about this in another Two Minute Tuesday, but follow up with your clients after the matter is closed and make sure they're satisfied. You know, ask them, what could we have done differently or better? Uh, are there things you really liked about what we did, uh, et cetera, et cetera, because you want to make sure that they're happy, especially with all the competition that's out there. Now, if you want to reach out to David and Karen, I would uh, encourage you to go to their website. It's Gimbal, G-I-M-B-A-L, Canada.com, Gimbal, Canada.com, and all of their tips are on there. They're also providing content for our online training site. And you can obviously find that at lawstrategycoach.thinkific.com. Again, lawstrategycoach.thinkific.com or email me at t at lawstrategycoach.com. I hope you'll join us for a two-minute Tuesday next week. Have a great rest of the week.